a typical diagnostic takes too long. It could be two days, three days, or it could be half a day or two hours. The current by traditional concept, the doctors out there is to cure the disease. If they don't have a disease, doctors don't treat them or patients don't go to see doctors. I used to work at a research facilities in the United States along with my wife. It used to talk us and our babies hours before we get to see a doctor and even longer before we get any treatment. And I keep asking myself, can we do better? Hopefully within the next few months we would have our first trial in Hong Kong and that would be building up to our usage and launch in Hong Kong. We believe POCT is a trend that's not just local but it's a global trend and it could really help people living in villages, remote areas, small towns and cities. We are trying to transform a diagnostic landscape which is your everyday go to doctor's experience. I have a background in pharmaceutical and radical medicine. I thought if we could know our body conditions earlier, that would give us a much better chance to get free of disease in the later development, especially as we are aging. For the condition-based services, we provide six areas like uh, mental health, cardiac protection, and uh, immunity, and detoxification, and uh, hormone balance, and muscle joint health, uh, as well as cancer early screening. Hong Kong people actually, they are relatively speaking, they are open to new things, such as preventive medicine. We need to educate the people even more in depth how this biological cellular information can help them. We chose Hong Kong to set up GoVita because Hong Kong is an international place that has for us much better to get international talents. When we founded our company, Hong Kong Science Park was the only and most logical choices for us to rent as a tenant. They have a state-of-the-art uh, centralized lab area that a lot of startups can share. At the Hong Kong Science Park, I think that's a very good environment for us to get together to share the experience we have. I always tell our team, we are doing this not just as a commercialized product, we are doing this for the good of the society. What we designed as a product was not originally intended for the current pandemic, but actually for all the outbreak situation scenarios, which is the overload of the fear and the overload of the public system. So we're trying to solve that problem. All the technology we develop is really we want to benefit people. Hopefully we can help people to prevent anything could happen, to understand their genetic or their current situation. We try to put those uh, so-called puzzle pieces together for a solutions for your health and live longer, live healthier, have a good quality of life. Mm -hmm.